There's nothing quite as luxurious as living in a neighborhood that is known to house only the rich. I mean, it's one thing to have all the money in your account and jet around the world as you please, but it's quite another to have a spot in an area reserved for only the filthy rich. The uber-rich generally prefer to mingle amongst people of their own financial status, and they often form little communities where you could hardly find the average Joe. These community members often send their kids to the same schools, shop at the same high-end stores, vacation at the same luxury locations, and live in luxurious mansions with infinity pools, helipads, and private lakes. The wealthiest members of society live hidden away in the most expensive neighborhoods. And if you've ever wondered what these neighborhoods look like, brace yourself as we take a look at the most expensive neighborhoods in the world. Knightsbridge, London. The United Kingdom is not hard-pressed for nice neighborhoods but Knightsbridge stands out as one of the poshest areas to live. It has the added advantage of being located in the popular and bustling city of London, and Knightsbridge is one of the most expensive residential streets in the city. The average price of a house in Knightsbridge is $15.6 million, a pretty steep price that the average 9 to 5 Joe might not be able to afford. This price is over 30 times the cost of an average home in London, and that's already saying something since London homes tend to be a bit more on the expensive side. With homes so expensive, it isn't so surprising that the average household income in this neighborhood lies around 500,000 pounds. If you're thinking about just heading to the neighborhood to find a small home to rent, you might want to halt your relocation plans. The area is highly popular among developers who have taken advantage of the booming real estate to build five-star hotels, luxurious apartments, designer stores, embassies, and other high-class buildings the rich want to spend all their money in. With so much glitz and glam to the place, it comes as no surprise that Knightbridge has attracted A-list celebrities such as the Beckhams and members of the Rolling Stones. Avenue Montaigne Avenue Montaigne is one address that immediately projects a life of riches and glamour. Located in Paris, this neighborhood is the place to be for everyone looking for a sophisticated and luxurious life in the city of love. This exclusive residential neighborhood has been home to some of the wealthiest people across the globe. You might think the major attraction lies within the luxurious buildings and beautiful scenery, but this neighborhood is actually over 300 years old. Its centuries-old cultural significance only adds to the appeal of the neighborhood, and people flock to Avenue Montaigne to get a taste of that old money. These days, Avenue Montaigne is packed with luxury stores. The stores are so upscale that in 2008, a jewelry store store was robbed of jewelry worth more than $108 million. Imagine having goods that amount just sitting in your store waiting for rich customers to come and buy them. Avenue Montaigne is also home to some of the most exclusive hotels, including Hotel Plaza Anthony, one of the oldest and most prestigious hotels in the world. Atherton, California. This neighborhood might not be as busy or located in the heart of a city as some of the others on this list but don't underestimate the capacities of this small town in San Francisco. In this neighborhood, even middle-class homes run into the millions of dollars category. That's mostly because the people living in this neighborhood are mostly billionaires from around the world. Atherton is home to large estates belonging to some of the biggest companies, so the pricey sales tags attached to the homes will most likely get even steeper within the coming years. The median home in this neighborhood is $5.5 million dollars and is home to Microsoft co-founder Paul Allen and a host of other big names. Paul Allen's estate holds the title of the most expensive sale in Atherton after he sold the luxury estate for 35 million dollars. Ostozhenka, Moscow. When we talk about luxury neighborhoods, we can't fail to mention this uber-exclusive neighborhood in Russia's famous city, Moscow. Russia has its share of extremely wealthy people, and where there are extremely wealthy wealthy people, you can expect high-end places where they can spend all that money. Ostozhenka is one of the oldest streets in Russia, and its rich history has only contributed to how expensive and deeply revered this neighborhood is. The neighborhood is home to some of the most popular landmarks in Russia, including 
the Kremlin and the Cathedral of Christ the Savior. Over the last decade, the neighborhood has only gotten more expensive, with some of the most expensive homes in Russia, including the recently sold $48 million property. Of course, a neighborhood as pricey as this one will have amenities to match its residents. Ostozhenka has some of Moscow's most exclusive restaurants and beautiful buildings, perfect for attracting tourists. Fifth Avenue, New York. A list of the most expensive neighborhoods in the world would hardly be complete without mentioning Fifth Avenue, New York. People from all over the world flock to New York for various reasons, mainly the tourist attractions. But the rich enjoy going to New York for the sense of luxury the place offers. New York might be notorious for some of its more rugged neighborhoods, but if you have the money and you know where to go, you should be quite all right. Fifth Avenue is one of New York's most luxury locations and has been a major tourist attraction for centuries now. Fifth Avenue has been the marketplace for some of the most expensive properties, but some of the most expensive ones now lie along 59th and 96th Street. The steep asking price for these homes is mostly due to the vantage point it has on Central Park. I mean, if you had huge wads of cash, you would also want to live in a home right across from Central Park, wouldn't you? Other than its beauty and expensive homes, Fifth Avenue also boasts some of the most expensive and high-end stores. Lovers of high fashion and designer items would be right at home walking in and out of luxurious stores like Armani, Bergdorf Goodman, and Zara. If designer retail outlets aren't your thing, surely you can appreciate the famous American landmarks such as the Empire State Building and the Rockefeller Center. Kensington Palace Gardens. So, you want to be neighbors with the royal family, and you think it would come cheap? Considered London's billionaire's row, Kensington Palace Gardens is undoubtedly one of the most expensive neighborhoods to live in. The average price per square meter in this neighborhood is an astonishing 107,000 US dollars, and we have to say we are not too surprised. Homes in this area are often placed on the market for anything starting from 190 million dollars, so you can't expect your average Joe to casually buy a home in this neighborhood. And the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge Cambridge setting up residents in this area definitely did not make real estate cheaper. Kensington Palace is home to the Russian, Japanese, and French embassies, and also houses some of the world's billionaires, including the owner of Chelsea FC, Roman Abramovich. But, of course, none of this neighborhood's residents are quite as famous as the Duke and Duchess of Cambridge and their family. Pollock's Path, The Peak Hong Kong. Pollock's Path is considered to be one of the most expensive neighborhoods in the world, and for good reason. Not only does it offer amazing views of Hong Kong Island and Victoria Harbor, but the peak is also located in a city that has been ranked the least affordable city to live in. Of course, the exclusivity that this neighborhood offers is what draws some of the wealthiest people in Hong Kong to it. Developers have taken good advantage of the market in this neighborhood, and prices have skyrocketed in the past few years as modern luxury properties spring up every year. The neighborhood only gained even more credibility as a place reserved for the extremely wealthy when it was rumored that Jack Ma purchased a $191 million property in 2015. That amount might seem crazy to you, but it's not a price most of the residents of this area would bat an eye at. And there you have it, folks. Thanks for watching this video. I hope you enjoyed a glimpse of the luxury luxurious lives some of the wealthiest folks in the world live. So, which of these neighborhoods will you be moving into? Let me know what you think in the comments section down below, and I will see you next time.